Oh, energy. Sometimes I think I'm running out of energy. Seems like we use an awful lot for heating and lighting and driving, reading and writing and jiving. Energy. You'd think we'd be saving it up. Energy. You can get it by damming up a river. Energy. A windmill can make the breeze deliver. But even with milling and damming, our needs are so much more demanding for energy. We have to use some kind of fuel. Chop, chop, chop. The cavemen use wood to stop the fires. Chop, chop, chop. They made all the tools that they require. Chop, chop, chop. Inventions got more and more inspired. The fires got higher and higher, and clearings got wider and wider. Energy, they were burning about all their wood up. Then one day, men discovered that coal would do it better. Miners dug, and it looked like it might just last forever. It seemed like the final solution. It started the Industrial Revolution. Energy, we could just keep on digging it up. Now, in 1859, way out in western Pennsylvania, a man had built a rig that got some laughs from folks who came there. But suddenly, a mighty roar came up from under the ground. Soon, a gush of gushing oil soaked all who stood around. Now, no one knew when that gusher blew, the petroleum years were honest, or that so many cars and trucks would come to cause a crisis. Energy, we're looking to try and find some new kinds. Energy, exploring to try and make a new find. Nuclear and thermal and solar, if we miss, we'll get colder and colder. Energy. We gotta stop using you up, so don't be cross. When mama says turn that extra light out, just turn it off till we find us a fuel that never runs out. If everyone tries a bit harder, our fuel will go farther and farther. In a Jeep, we're gonna be stretching you hard. 